Driving Miss Daisy and the way basically um, Driving Miss Daisy is a uh, kind of older movie, 1989, I believe, starring Morgan Freeman and uh, the lady's name is escaping me. I apologize, but uh, it actually won the Academy Award for Best Picture. And when I watched it, um, what what really was interesting about it is it's it's pretty much a f- just cut and it's 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 just a feel good movie and the performances are great and the uh, characters kind of grow on each other obviously uh Miss Daisy in the very beginning doesn't really want to have anything to do with uh Morgan Freeman and this takes place you know right as Martin Luther King starting to uh get the civil rights movement and stuff kind of going and so there is some um, obvious racism in, in it, uh, not from Miss Daisy though, but uh, but just you know basic uh, basic situations where um, you know Morgan Freeman is in these situations. You know, there's a, a situation with some police officers where where uh, some sh- slurs and stuff are used, and uh, the film's really about the two characters growing and growing together. And really about Morgan Freeman's character, you know, never giving up on uh, Miss Daisy. He's always, always working to improve their relationship. And sooner or later, Miss Daisy knows that he's not there just for the money or anything like that. He's there for, uh, he's there to support her and even goes and sees her after certain situations and stuff happen in the film. And the whole entire time I was watching it, um, all I felt was, you know, that feel good feeling, you know, like the Forrest Gump level feel good feeling, you know, where you can sit down and watch a film and you know, okay, well, no matter, no matter what happens, like the characters are both nice to each other. They're both growing and you're like, unless if some serious situation happened where a character did a 180, there's no bad way this film can end. It's, it's going to end on kind of a feel good note. And, there's some kind of emotional moments in it, but not, I wouldn't necessarily say too emotional. It's not like anything like the end of Forrest Gump or anything like that. But, uh, the film, in my opinion, I'd give it like a seven. It's, it's pretty good. Um, it's pretty short too. And if you're looking for a film that's a feel good movie where you can just sit down with your family and, uh, and get a positive experience out of it, I mean, I don't know how you could watch this film and not get a positive experience out of it. So if, you're looking for a movie where you can kind of sit down and get a get a 100% positive experience and no real uh, thought provoking stuff kind of going on. It's just uh, there to uh, there to entertain you and and there to help help you kind of or, or show the growth of the characters and that's that's really the whole arc of the film and and the characters don't really do anything but that. Um, other than that, the acting is incredible. Um, the direction and stuff is pretty good. Uh, Cinematography wise, there's nothing real crazy going on. It's pretty uh, average level stuff. But um, so that's pretty much it, you guys. I got I got another meeting that I got to go to. So I just thought I'd jump on here real quick and stick to my commitment no matter how late it is and get on here and give you guys a film review a day. So obviously 365 films, what I'm doing is I'm re- reviewing a film a day for 365 days. I watch and review a new movie every single day for the entire year. So I'm on day eight now before you know it. I'll be halfway done with this. So uh, I really appreciate you guys getting on here and sharing this out. Uh, Possibly, I really enjoy actually answering the questions in the beginning. So at some point, I might do a QA and a and show you guys uh, kind of more of my film background and more of what I'm I'm kind of into and stuff so you guys can kind of see where my opinions are coming from on this stuff. But I appreciate you guys getting on here and I appreciate you sharing it out. And I I, I love you guys very much. So thank you so much for getting on here. And uh, I'll have another film review for you guys tomorrow. I don't know what film it's going to be. My uh, sister-in-law gave me a film to watch, so I might watch that tomorrow. Um, I don't remember the exact name of it, but uh, I'll probably end up watching that. So thank you so much, guys. Uh, Talk to you tomorrow. Thank you.